Hi everyone and welcome back to Dr. Dave's 411. Today we have a very special episode because tomorrow is a very special day. Yes, you guessed it. Tomorrow is Women's Heart Awareness Day. In fact, if you are a woman or care for one, then you need to watch this episode. It may change or even save a life. Okay, so now I have your attention. If you are a female, I want to ask you a question. Have you ever had a mammogram? Right about now, you're looking at me like I'm crazy. Dr. Dave, how can you even ask such a ridiculous question? Okay, I agree. Mammograms are very important because breast cancer kills approximately 1 in 30 women. So let me ask you another question. Have you ever had a mammogram of your heart? Well, I don't mean literally a mammogram of the heart, but a test that has the same amount of low radiation, approximately 10 chest x-rays, has no IV and takes about five to 10 minutes to complete and can help predict your risk of having a heart attack. Yes, I am speaking about the coronary calcium score. Odds are, unless you are a regular on Dr. Dave's 411, I would bet you never even heard of a coronary calcium score. It amazes me that women are screened so well for breast cancer, but very poorly for heart disease. Heart disease is one of the most underappreciated diseases in women, yet it remains the number one killer. Remember, we said that breast cancer kills approximately one in 30 women, but cardiovascular disease kills one in three. So why aren't we doing a better job of preventing these mostly preventable deaths? Some of the reasons heart disease affects so many women are as follows. Number one, lack of awareness. Number two, women have different hearts and symptoms. And number three, misconceptions of heart disease in women. Number one, lack of awareness. The cardiology community and the health community as a whole need to do a better job of making women aware of how prevalent heart disease is and help them get screened before they have a problem. We need to learn from our breast cancer colleagues who have done an amazing job promoting breast cancer screening. Number two, women have different hearts and symptoms. Women's hearts are different. Women have smaller hearts and smaller arteries. Women also have different symptoms than men. For example, one study showed that the most common symptoms women have one month before a heart attack can be very different than men. In fact, only 30% of women reported chest discomfort before their heart attack. The most common symptoms in descending order included new unusual fatigue or fatigue you cannot explain, sleep disturbances, shortness of breath, indigestion, and anxiety. Number three, misconceptions of heart disease in women. For many years, there has been a misunderstanding that women don't have as much heart disease as men. So their symptoms must be from something other than their heart. In fact, one study showed over half of women hospitalized with heart attacks were initially told their symptoms weren't related to a heart condition. So let this week and the entire Heart Awareness Month remind everyone that women not only suffer from heart disease as much as men, they are more likely to die from it. So please speak to your doctor about getting screened for heart disease. It may just save your life. Until next time, this is Dr. Dave.